News today, an accused killer makes his first appearance in court after police say he killed his ex-wife and stole their five-year-old child almost one week ago. News 9's Haley Wagger is in Cleveland County with what the suspect had to say. Ainsworth faced the court over video conference today from Cleveland County Jail, where he's charged with one count of first degree murder and another of kidnapping a child. Chase Ainsworth is the man that triggered the endangered persons alert last weekend. In court today, the state of Oklahoma said Ainsworth slit his ex wife's throat in front of their two young children, then kidnapped their five year old son. When asked if he had any questions for the court, Ainsworth called his jail time cruel and unusual punishment and asked how soon his case would go to trial. In a statement, District Attorney Greg Mashburn said this is a devastating situation and we will be reaching out to Ms. Ainsworth's family to assure them that we intend to prosecute this case to the fullest extent of the law. The judge entered a not guilty plea for Ainsworth along with the $4 million bond. The state called for the high price bond, saying he had previous felony stalking charges and violated the victim protective order filed against him by the ex-wife he killed last weekend. Samantha Ainsworth filed for divorce in 2022, just a few months after she filed a victim protection order against her ex-husband. In a statement, D.A. Mashburn said, we know that stalking behavior can be dangerous and bring devastating outcomes. He encourages anybody experiencing stalking or domestic violence to reach out to the domestic violence hotline. Ainsworth is expected in court again on September 5th at 9 a.m. At the Cleveland County Courthouse, Haley Waker, Oklahoma's own News 9.